Hello everybody and welcome to this episode of Programming and Algorithms. In this episode we'll look at binary search. So binary search is a way of sorting an algorithm or rather finding a value in an algorithm. As I said the word sorting though, the data has to be sorted first. So in this case what we have to do is put the number two, put the two twos at the start, then the four next, move the five across here, put the six here and the eight here. How we might sort the data we'll think about in a different video, but for the moment let's assume we have an array that's completely sorted. If we have an array that's completely sorted, what we do is we create two variables that we're going to represent with these two pens. One is at the start and one is at the end of the array. And then we calculate the middle of the array, a third value. And if the number we're looking for, let's say it's number nine, if we're looking for the number 9, we, look, we, we check if the number 9 is between 2 and 5 or between 5 and 9. Well, the number 9 is between 5 and 9. So, we have the start, the finish, and the middle. We, t we take away the middle and say, now this is the start, and we forget about this half of the array completely. So now we want to go to the middle of this array, this part of the array, and say, is 9 in between the start and the middle or between the middle and the end and we know that 9 is between the middle and the end so we take away this part of the array. Now we look at the array what's left and we say is the number 9 either at the start or the end or the middle of this? Well it's at the end so we found the number 9 quite quickly so in three moves we have found the number we're looking for quite quickly. This is a much faster way of doing the search than sequential search. With sequential search, if there's a hundred values, we have to search all of the hundred values. With a binary search, if there's a hundred values, we should be able to find it in five or six goals at most. But it does require that the data is sorted in the first place, unlike a sequential search. So the theory is simple again. Have a start and a finish, have a middle. If if the value, let's say, was two we were looking for, we we're looking for all the twos then we'd say, well, is the number 5 bigger than 2 or less than 2? 5 is bigger, so we'll discard all of these guys, and we're just going to look for 2s between the start and the finish. And we'll find, we'll go to the middle again, and lo and behold, we'll find what we're looking for. We'll find our 2, and in fact, we'll find two twos quite quickly like that. So binary search is a very fast, efficient way. But remember, it's got to be sorted. Thanks very much. We'll see you on the next episode.